This is WPTV. I'm proud to say that in less than 40 days, I'll be walking across the stage at the Prudential Center, kissing President Heldobler on the cheek, I'm gonna make his willpower, and he'll hand me my degree with a bachelor's in communication. Now, although I'm excited to be finally done with college, I'm trying to figure out what's next. You know, I could use my degree and acquired skills to try to find a reasonable entry-level job in the radio or TV industry, or I could go back to my part-time job as a manager at Rita's, getting spit on because we don't have coconut water ice today. What's disappointing is, out of the two options, the latter is more probable, and the reason why might not be that surprising. More and more Americans are asking themselves, is a college degree still worth it? Some colleges now raising tuition as much as 5% citing inflation after tuition costs remain stable for a majority of the pandemic. A survey released this month by bestcolleges.com finds 44% of currently enrolled undergraduate students with federal or private loans have considered dropping out of school due to the financial burden. So you're telling me that everybody waited until now to start having this discussion? I'm 40 days away, damn it. Seriously though, I wish y'all could have had this conversation three years ago when I was going on hikes with my environmental science class. What the hell am I supposed to do with that? I'm a comm major. Or when my history professor tried to fail me freshman year because I didn't know who won the French and Indian War. The man's was so old it could have been him. Seriously though, over 40% of people with college degrees are saying that it did not end up being worth it, either because it didn't properly set them up for their career or because the benefits don't outweigh its costs. I mean, think about it. In New Jersey, it costs over $30,000 on average to attend college every single year. To put that in perspective, it costs less money to buy a 2023 Honda Civic than it does to go to one year of school. The price of college in America is getting so high, even Snoop Dogg had to say chill out. Americans have actually been going to places like Germany and Iceland and to be able to afford going to school. And I'm about to get my ass deported so I can afford college and get free health care. Look, most people who attend a four-year institution are under the impression that when they graduate, a job that will steadily help them pay back what they spent on college will be waiting for them. But that's damn near impossible when the cost of education is growing faster than the mold on the third floor of Heritage. A lot of people think that college is only worth it if you get an extremely high-paying job afterwards. But, you know, only one out of ten business leaders strongly agree that college graduates have the skills that their workplaces need. Now, to be transparent, let me be the first to say that when this guy started applying for college back in, Jesus, <laughs> when he started, where's his beard? Uh, when he started applying for college back in 2018, I didn't think a degree was necessary. At the time, neither my mom nor my dad had one, and there were plenty of celebrities who didn't go to college, who ended up in the fields that I wanted to go work in. To clarify, I mean field of work, not field of cotton. I don't think Kevin Hart ever ended up in a cotton field. It's beside the point. <laughs> I, think, I don't think a degree was necessary. And I knew the only reason I wanted to go to college back then was to gain experiences and make connections. So today, I can confidently sit up here and say that I do think college is worth it. Now, that might just be because I haven't seen the student loans rolling in yet, so ask me again in a few months. And not for nothing, but the same experiences and connections that I came to college for got me an internship at SiriusXM. Humble brag. Sirius, hire me, please. Full time. Benefits. But that's, not, that's what I'm saying, though. I'm not gonna get a job or an internship without a minimum of a bachelor's degree and two to four years of experience, but it still seems like that's not even enough because not all degrees are created equal. Let's move on. College has definitely been an experience, from the president of the university lying to my face to dorming with a girl who had demonic dreams where she'd start clapping and apologizing to her mom. I'm still gonna march on with positivity and say that college has been worth it. I just heard that People with, the, with bachelor's degrees typically earn 84% more in their lifetime than people with just a high school diploma. That means I'm in the top 97 percentile of earnings compared to high school grads. <laughs> Come on now. I promise you right now that math was not correct. My dad, who's a math teacher, will probably be disappointed at me. Look, I don't get it. What can kids be studying that would make them regret going to college? Journalism, sociology, liberal arts, communic... God damn it! Come on! I'm less than a month away, don't tell me that. You're gonna make me wanna click my heels together like Dorothy in The Wizard of Oz and say, there's no more student loans, there's no more student loans, there's no more student loans. <sighs> All right, let's get to the point. The point is, college is so much more than just a degree. It depends on who you are and how you use your degree, it depends on what you're gonna pursue, and it depends on how you're able to network. Like I said, there's tens of thousands of people who are doing what I wanna do and have a college degree, they dropped out of college, they haven't stepped foot in a college. I only came to college to network and to build my resume, but I promise you that that was the plan that worked for me. 
true story, my dad graduated uh, with his bachelor's in 2021. And now he's graduating with me next month with his master's. And he just became a teacher not even two years ago. I've taken a crap ton of radio and TV and film courses in the past four years, but I regret not taking some type of business or management classes to help me learn how to make back the money that college stole from me. Regardless though, college has been so beneficial to me in so many different facets. I've met so many people, I've built an extensive network, uh, I've developed so many skills. I, sorry. Hello? Yeah, this is he. I can't graduate. I, I have to fulfill one more credit? In, in geometry? What am I supposed to do with shapes and radio? This is bullshit. All right, we have more video later after the break. I have to go take care of this. Sorry, it's about.